Welcome to English Video Tutor Lesson 3D. Okay, in this lesson, I'm going to go through uh, the combinations. I'm going to go through combinations of letters here uh, that have unique sounds. Uh, mostly two letter combinations like A, A, C, H, and uh, each of them have uh, unique sounds in English. So I'll go through uh, most of them. Okay. Um, first, um, a a. All right. The sound of these this two letter combination is ah. So an example of that would be aardvark. Uh, C H. Another two letter combination. The sound of that is C H. So an uh, example of uh, a letter, uh, I mean a word for CH, which includes CH, is China. And uh, KEE, -E, uh, the sound, the two letters combination E, e sounds like E. So uh, example, beer, two letter combinations, uh, EA, and that sounds exactly like EE. -E. It's uh, E, example, meat, E, I. Okay, uh, this sounds like A. So, the combination of E, I sounds like A. So, example of a word. Uh, with E-I, eight. So E-I sounds like A, eight. A uh, word with E-U. As the two letter combinations E-U sounds U. So a word, neutral. Neutral. Okay, N-G. N-G, the two letter combination N-G. Sounds like n, mm, a word, sing. O, O, sounds like u, a word with O, O, goose, O, A. Okay, uh, what does O, A sounds like? O, so a word with O, A would be boat. So, um, when you remember O A, it just sounds like O, right? It sounds like O without the A. So you just ignore the A and then just pronounce it boat. O E, same thing. Ignore the E. Don't don't pronounce the E. So a word uh, which includes O E would be toe. Okay, uh, with O I. Uh, it sounds different depending on how you use it. With this word, right, boil, you you uh, pronounce the O first and then the I. So it goes like boy ill, boil. Uh, for this one, it just goes oi, right? The sounds of O and I together would be oi, noise. Okay. O U. Uh, and that sounds like ow. Example of a word with O U cloud. Cloud uh, has an O U in it. Okay. P H. P H. This sounds just like F. Alright, so P H, a word that has uh, pH in it would be F phone and then Q U. Q U, it uh, sounds like qu, a word that with Q U would be quartz. Quartz. S S, just um, there's a two letter combination, two, two S's. It just sounds like S. Jos. And a word with two S would be glass. Uh, this one, T H. T H. It sounds, um, it sounds like T, it sounds like you stick your tongue out and then you, uh, 
you pronounce, you, you blow out while you have your tongue beneath your, uh, with your tongue between your teeth. So, a word with th would be throw, throw. Well, again, the way you pronounce it is with your tongue out be between your teeth. Okay, uh, next word, ginger. So, G-I, ginger, uh, G-E, gems, gems. So, in these two cases, the G uh, sounds, G sounds like J. Okay, ginger, gems. So, in these two cases, it doesn't sound like G. It sounds like J, J. So, ginger, gems. Remember with uh, I in it in front of the G and E in front of the G. Gems, ginger. Uh, okay, and uh, CH, uh, the way you pronounce it is uh, you ignore the H. So, in this word, you pronounce CH exactly with a C, but ignore the H. You don't hear the H, so you pronounce this chrome. Chrome. Okay, with uh, O U now, O W E now. Uh, o W uh, depends on how you use it, uh, and it depends on how what word it is. And in this word, uh, you ignore the W, so it's toe. Right, you ignore the W, uh, so. T O W would be pronounced toe, and in this, O W sounds exactly like O U. So uh, O W and O U it sounds the same, and you pronounce O W ow. And in this word, down, down. Okay, uh, so these are just uh, two-letter combinations of a uh, word, and. Um, you know how they sound, they have unique sounds too. And that concludes um, English Video Tutor Lesson 3B. In the next lesson, I will go through nouns and uh, verbs. Uh, nouns are uh, parts of speech, and so are verbs. A noun is an object, something, and a verb uh, is a word uh, that. Uh, signifies some sort of action, right? A noun is like an object, right? So, an object, pen, right? And a noun would be like pen, or a verb would be like uh, um, lift, right? So, anyway, that's for the next lesson. Okay, that's it.